do you think? Well, Jack, we're going to have a very hot show today. Shall I stop on my milk? If you pour it in all at once, you... You get scrambled eggs, so... Then this has to beat until it's thick and pale yellow. Yes, this is the delicate part. Go on beating until it thickens. Why put it directly in there? You could make it richer with half and half or whatever you want, but I'm just doing a simple diet. The way I get it is by going into it. Do you think that's enough? Oh, that's plenty, I think. That's plenty. Yes. We got to be careful. So I'll go, and when it starts thickening, I'll yell. You should wait at least five minutes. Yes, I will. So what you have to do is to melt your butter. We'll also see a little whiff of steam coming up. It does quite a lot. And one indication that it's thickening is that you see this surface foam. In the hot milk? Hot milk. Right. One of the basic dessert sauces that you got to have in your repertoire. Yes. And you will find out that it dries out half a minute or so to dry it out a little bit. See, it makes a ribbon on the surface. So you will push that through it after? But a lot of people aren't doing that anymore, mainly because they don't know how, I think. Theoretically, you should not put your eggs on something very hot. And now I want to have hot milk gradually beaten in. And that's what I want, to dry it out a little bit. That could be mixed by hand. And that prepares the yolks for the horrors that are to come. <laughs> Doesn't it? Now stir it around. And then with a sturdy spoon like this, you work it around. Then they lose the feeling of egg. Right. That will begin to subside. It's starting getting cakey. It looks beautiful to me. It does quite a lot. Mm -hmm. 